reports are coming out. Concerns that people are having. H and R Block cancellations. They're receiving a lot of cancellations these days. And H and R Block, people don't know, obviously is a company based on doing tax returns uh, for people, mainly for individuals, um, but as well as accountants are reporting an increase in cancellations of their appointments with people um, trying to file their taxes. Um, this year, we are seeing an increase of people not filing their taxes, which is absolutely crazy if true. We've been looking into it on our own, um, trying to come across the numbers and stats on our own, but right now it's a lot of anecdotes, mm -hmm. so we can't really speak for sure of if this is happening, how much, if it is happening across the country, or if it's just kind of focused to a specific area. Um, but right now, from just the anecdotes that we know, people are struggling financially. People are struggling to cover their, their bills. And they're, they might be looking at their taxes and seeing, shoot, I owe money this year? Maybe I'll just push this off to next year and not file at all. Is We're seeing more of that this year, which I think is a very crazy storyline, especially based on the backdrop of everything we've been happening and what we've been seeing in politics this year. Yeah, and honestly... I filed my taxes about two weeks ago because I knew I was getting money back. Oh, you're, you're, you're a good boy. <laughs> I, no, I, I was, I'm going to be intoxicated is uh, what I call it. Oh my gosh. <laughs> it's when the money flows this way. Okay, let's go. <laughs> so I took advantage of the first time home buyer's savings account. And so I set one up for myself and I set one up for my wife. We each dumped eight grand to the, to both of us. So we were able to take 16 grand off of our, off of our uh, tax returns. I also did 15 grand worth of education. So that came off as well. And then where Jen went on maternity leave, uh, so we had our daughter, uh, we had a bunch of medical expenses that uh, we were able to claim. Oh, nice. So it turned out to be quite a bit of money that we were able to claim and then made it uh, quite a bit of money to come back to us. It's almost two weeks. It still has not been deposited in my account yet. That is new. So last year when I filed, I filed mid-March. And so this, I filed early March. I was like, oh yeah, it's going to get in here early because, you know, not a lot of people do it early. They leave it to the very last minute. That's just the way humans are. And yeah, still nothing in my bank account yet. Like that's, that's new. That's the first time for me. So usually like last year it took, I think it was like three or four days. Year before that, it took about a week, um, but never two weeks. So we're getting on almost two weeks now and no tax return in my bank account. So yeah, if you're not filing your taxes, like who cares? All the power to you because even when you do file them, knowing that you're getting a return, the return doesn't come. <laughs> <laughs> so I'll keep you updated when that lands, but uh, it's been a while. Oh, they equally so on their end too. That's what yeah. I'm hearing. Yeah, of course. We love to see it. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. It's uh, I admittedly, again, I I've, I don't think I've seen anything like this personally in my lifetime. I'm sure it's probably happened at other points in history. Uh, I can't really speak to it because I don't know. Um, but knowing what I'm seeing on the on the streets, <laughs> uh, you know, I'm seeing in terms of stats of mortgage delinquencies, which we'll get into here shortly. Um, people um, seeing the price of food, people not being able to afford food. Um, as I said off the top, um, you know, family members in the hospital. I've uh, been seeing a lot of homeless people coming in the hospital mm -hmm. and, and taking things yep. and, and leaving. Um, that's been happening more too. So it, people are in need. People are struggling. And so I'm not surprised to hear that people are like, you know, I'm not going to file this year. And it's funny that those who are a little, a little more politically inclined are be like, well, yeah, protest. <laughs> Show them what's up. They're giving money to Ukraine. Trudeau's paying off a rife scam. Um, this is what this is what the government gets, and it's like, it's it's no, it's not really like that. I think it's mainly people who are just struggling who don't have the money to. If they do yeah. owe, they don't have the money to give up right now. 